greatest. <laughs> this is Kathy Brox for LUTG Radio, and it's 7:45 in the a.m. this November 2nd, 2012. We're supposed to get a high of 50 in the shy, y'all. Mmm. Woo. That's so warm and toasty. <laughs> hey, definitely pray for the folks that are sleeping out on the streets. Whether they in the shy or in New York City, sleeping in their cars, trying to get some gas or whatever it is. Definitely pray for them, all of the East Coast that's having it a little bit hard. Definitely pray for patience, that people may be patient. Yesterday they showed folks on the news arguing over gas and a spot in line. What's up? Hey, don't give yourself a heart attack, alright? Chill. It's rough, but fighting each other don't make it any better. Chill out. Be kind to one another. God got it. God got you. And don't forget, don't forget, Indiegogo.com forward slash L-U-T-G freaking radio, y'all. Fundraiser. L-U-T-G radio. Fundraiser. We got a uh, fundraiser at uh, Indiegogo.com forward slash L-U-T-G radio fundraiser. I definitely need you to give. I mean, you don't have to have the George Lucas kind of money where you could donate billions of dollars, although I would appreciate it. If you got a dollar, donate it. I appreciate it. You got ten dollars, twenty dollars, hundred dollars, thousand dollars, ten thousand, hundred thousand, million. Go, you know, look. Do you? I appreciate it. I really do. I really do. I'm not just joking here. I appreciate it. We we definitely uh, need a heads up on it. And uh, to all of my Air Force buddies out there, y'all listening in. Hey, uh, chill out. No brawling, boo. You gonna exert that energy soon? Uh, talk to your wife, call your wife, call your girl, you know, go meet up with them, you know, expel some of that energy, y'all ain't got to be fighting all the time, fighting each other, what's up, it's all love, it's all love, yeah, they had a brawl the other day after they, uh, after the event, after one of the annual events, I'll put that uh, link on chat, <laughs> alright, so we got more music for you, we got the vocabulary word halfway through, and we got uh, the altar call in the last five minutes of the show. But until then, we're going to wash your brain with a little bit of Carl Moses. Yep.
electric. Welcome to the scene. I wanna go electric. My car's real mean. No need for a pump. No matter where I are. No need to wait in line. Just put it on charge. Do you like my electric car? Go for my electric car. Do you like my electric car? Go for my electric car.
Alright, y'all. Thank you so much for coming back. We got, uh, it's time for the vocabulary word of the day. Um, I'm using the Hebrew and Aramaic dictionary. It's a strong, uh, Strong's Expanded Dictionary. Uh, yeah, Strong's Expanded Dictionary of Bible Words, written by James Strong. Uh, alright, so I'm on page, uh, 599, and I'm on reference number 4268. And the word is spelled M A C H A C E H, and it's pronounced Mak Az. Wait a minute. Mak Aza, Mak Aza. Or you can pronounce it Makse, Mak Aza or Makse. But it means uh, a shelter, hope, a place of refuge. Makse, Makase, Makse. Just say Makse, just to be easy. Makse. It means uh, trust, shelter, hope, a place of refuge. And that's what Jesus is, a place of refuge. You know? Hey, there we go. All right, so we got more music for you. We got a new song called Dreaming by Vicky Vito. Yep, I, I, yeah, Vicky. Oh, I'm sorry. Oh, it's not Vicky, it's Vic. Dude, you, you spell your name like that and... I know you sound like a dude, but I'm like, I know this is a dude, but why does he have a girl's name? But, uh, it's, he spells Vic, V-I-C-K-E. And most of us spell Vic, V-I-C. Eh, or V-I-C-K. We never put an E on the end. But that's cool. That's cool. Alright, Vic Vito. Yeah, dream it. We got an altar call in less than 10, y'all. With your swab, yeah. Sometimes I, I just don't know. Donnie Klein, Vic Vito. I don't know. I don't know. In my dream, in my dream. Sometimes I feel as if I'm falling But if my back bore wings I would soar to the highest acclamation I'm running out of patience But I ain't in a hurry Funerals is really practice For the day you dead and buried The stars got me Time checking It's 6 a.m. in the city A good night means the women in bottles were plenty I backtracked to the shows with a feet And I noticed that the cars was all mine The whole fleet Damn, I'm up grinding, no sleep Somebody thinking about the city I'ma purchase next week The streets glow when I walk People listen when I speak Hate cease to exist in the minds of the meek Perish. I disappear in a flash, but I still got a lot of questions that I didn't ask. Blissfully, I drift off as she whispered, he is Vicky V, but Victor is still a mystery. What if I'm dreaming, dreaming, I'm the one that's really messed up, what am I thinking? Time for me to wake myself up Can somebody pinch me To be sure me That it was all Just a dream Right, I still feel as if I'm falling but if my back bore wings when I finally reached the bottom, I stop. Float above my problems till I make it to the top and let them slowly be the reason for my downfall. Where would I be without y'all? I shed waterless tears for all my past loves, hoping for a brighter future. My present love is elusive and I don't think she's exclusive, but my heart can only focus on the good, only focus on what should be. In my life, what the mind say? My mind state is never mind what the mind say. Cause we acting on feeling, and my cards are face up. Not to mention I'm dealing, no secrets. So my fate revealed to the crowd. I never knew that silent talks was supposed to be this loud. I close my ears and start to go numb, clicking like Dorothy and screaming name name till I'm back to where I came from. What if I'm dreaming? What if I'm the one that's really messed up? 
time for me to make myself up And somebody teach me To be sure That it was all Just a dream What if I'm dreaming What if I'm the one that's really messed up Swallowed into the septic tank with no piggy bank to crack. Only then stashed at the bottom of the pocket. Left in a dark room with no socks to plug in your lamp of vision. So in between these four walls, you stay hidden from the choices, voices, and things in the outer limits. Always looking for ways to make time diminish and finish each day. Just to make it to the next, which leaves time for stress, but no time for rest. Cause what you're going through seems to be unexplainable. And what you need seems to be unattainable or too far for your arms to reach. It's like you're falling down in this permanent track meet. So it's hard to find proof of light when the darkness never seems to leave. Never seems to leave. We get too anxious, too over animated, over the edge, over stressed and over dilated to the surroundings that's pounding your chest from the nine to five plus the overtime added in excess baggage that's too heavy to hold when the tremble never stops but only seems to go as you let it move yourself towards burnout and suffer from exhaustion and always get tossed into the marathon the schedule's always filled to the top you got places to go people to see so the cycle never stops only rocks the brain with robotic patterns no chance to re-angle cause it's already tatted and etched in the mind with permanent ink so it's hard to find a solution to change things cause we're the maker of our own demise as we live in the schedule and watch the time go by. I take one step on top of the bottle as the whole world fades away. I feel like the end of my life is all that on my face. I don't know if I can find my way back to a boss I know it's true. Unravel thoughts, intertwine with their emotions, and the tidal waves of life keep you roller coasting through memories amongst rainbows once held, like leprechauns and pots of gold, only to expose crumpled currency and let drown in deep pockets. Destinations or reach breaks pain, like lost love was taking residence and cheap lockets around your neck, causing added baggage to each step as you tremble the earth's spine and search for what's left. Only hopes to make it, crying for help as each world falls short of the next soul that's vacant, so you travel on into the clutches of death, like the fall of Babylon. On, blind to the fact that we've been blessed with wings Only to take flights once the light is seen I said blind to the fact that we've all been blessed with wings Only to take flight once the light is seen I take one step on top of the bottle As the whole world fades away I feel like I'll get the other side It's all that on my face I don't know if I can find my way Back to the voice I know it's true
this is Kathy Bronx for LUTG Radio. And it's time for the altar call, y'all. For God so loved the world that he gave his only begotten son, that whosoever believe in him should not perish, but have everlasting life. For God did not send his son into the world to condemn the world, but that through him the world might be saved. Amen, amen, amen. That is for you, for me, every Jew and every Gentile. Yep. Jesus loves you. There's no doubt. Um, either you're with him or you're against him. Um, like a pastor Prince said, you can't really try faith. You can either put it on or take it off. So, because trying is like, it's kind of like being a little bit pregnant or having sex a little bit. <laughs> I know I'm using some adult language here, but y'all know what I'm talking about. For you folks out there. Baby, let me just try a little bit. I just do it halfway. Just halfway. Just a little bit. Just halfway. I just want to see how I feel. Just halfway. Before you know it. Whoops. All the way in and ain't taking it out. You can't do faith halfway. It's either all the way or not at all. So, uh, I say that to say, Give your life to God and let him show you the beautiful things that he can do with it and open up uh, all the mysteries to you that are you. Because you have so many talents that are yours that you haven't even tapped into because you don't have the revelation for it. And you don't. You, you also need a relationship with God to access it. You're like, but wait, I'm a rapper. I'm famous. I got money. True. But what else are you capable of? What else can you do? You know, hey, I'm just saying. Well, I'm a doctor. I get awards. I make lots of money. I'm the head of surgery. Okay, cool. What else can you do? I'm George Lucas. I got a lot of money. I made films. I bless people. I give people stuff. Cool. But even George Lucas is saying, hey, what else can I do? Hey, we all ask that question. And sometimes we go on these different journeys trying to find it. But all you gotta do is call on Jesus. He's the beginning and the end. Alright? So I'm giving you an opportunity uh, to receive Jesus Christ as your Lord and Savior. The Word of God says that if you confess with your mouth that Jesus is Lord and believe in your heart that God raised him from the dead, then you shall be saved. So here's the confession part. Let's do it. Lord, I know I am a sinner. I know I can't earn or buy my way into heaven. I want to know your pure love. Lord, I freely accept Jesus Christ as my Savior and Lord of my life. From this day forward, I give my life to you, Jesus. Direct me in all my ways and keep me on your righteous path. I have faith in the blood of Jesus. Set me in the atmosphere of learning in a Bible-based church. In your name, Jesus, thank you. Amen. Facebook.com forward slash L-U-T-G radio. Click, click on the link, find a church, and uh, take your foundation classes and your intercessory classes. All right, so you can know who you are in Christ Jesus. Don't forget, Indiegogo.com forward slash L-U-T-G radio fundraiser. Give, 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 please, so we can expand the station, get our call letters and everything, get the equipment we need, and definitely the space. All right, we're going to go 24-7 playing music for you, offering altar calls. Now, earlier I said I would put up the link uh, about the 30 soldiers brawling. It's, been, it's all over the internet. You're going to have to look for it. I tried to put it up, but um, sometimes my chat won't take it because the links are too long. I tried to put up another link, and uh, it was like, you know, almost a thousand characters. That's a lot. <laughs> my chat was like, uh uh, sorry. No, baby. Try another. <laughs> all right, come back for the last segment, which is Ministry Minutes. All right, and uh, we'll be back in about five. Love you.